This is my vocabulary lesson plan, and my students will be identifying the definitions of vocabulary words through an interactive class read aloud of an article. My lesson objective would be the students will use context clues while reading an article during an interactive read, read aloud to determine a definition of a vocabulary word. Uh, what I really like about this is that the students are getting vocabulary words multiple times through the article. So a student could see a word, maybe not figure out its definition by that sentence, but then later in the article use multiple times of that word being used to figure out its meaning and use what's before the word, after the word, and all the context clues in order to figure out that word. So in prior student knowledge for this is my lesson is about Martin Luther King and the Civil Rights Movement. So they are familiar with Martin Luther King and the Civil Rights Movement. My students, for the most part, can also comprehensively read and use phonics to sound out unfamiliar words. My students can also formulate an appropriate definition using context clues collaboratively with table partners. The students are still working towards independently being able to identify definitions of vocabulary words using context clues. My students have worked together reading and determining definitions in my class with previous assignments. I've exampled a proper technique of doing this and showing examples. Students could identify wrong definitions for the words they choose. And by doing this, they could choose a word they don't, that doesn't really have much context or is really not relevant to the content. So my unit goal is by the end of the unit, students will be able to use context clues and reading strategies to determine definitions of vocabulary. My summative assessment is that reading an article with high academic language and determining meaning of the vocabulary word independently. So the formative assessment I will use is an exit ticket. And on this exit ticket, my students will be filling out a five question multiple choice quiz that identifies a vocabulary word using a sentence and then students are choosing one of the four definitions that best define that vocabulary word. So a student that received an advanced rate would be seven out of seven on that, or five out of five on that quiz. A student at a satisfactory rate would be three or four and under, unsatisfactory would be three or less. My curriculum standard is to determine the meaning of general academic and domain specific words and phrases in a text relevant to a grade three topic or subject area.